Okay, now we can continue. No uh, freezing while loading. It's okay. Okay. <laughs> Cozy's up, hey cat. Sorry, I was all tabbed out. I couldn't see Twitch chat for a sec. Because it locked up on me. Yes, the cat was called Beans. I played uh, yesterday and today during the day, so it's like 14 days. You're gonna hate me, but like I got Ancient Fruit on, I forgot what day, but like, single digits. been cool so far. I gotta say though, the fields are a bit empty. I would have expected more on the extra areas to the right. But maybe I haven't seen what there is to see yet, so who knows. But it's just this vast area and then there's just a train station over there. I don't know. I got strawberries to plant. That area is weird. Yeah, it almost feels like it's like a coming soon. Like maybe they're not finished. The kind of stuff that you see in a beta and then it's like, oh yeah, this area is not finished yet. It just seemed very placeholder like. Because there was a road to the, the right as well that looked like you could keep going, but it doesn't look like you can keep going. But I mean, outside of that, it's cool so far. Okay. Um, I need to check the radius. Is there a key to see the radius of stuff? Or do you have to, like... Do you have to remove it and put it back? Hang on. You don't think so, okay. And there's new fish. I'll keep that in mind. Uh, okay. I guess just keep going this way. I don't want to overdo it. Um, Haley's birthday, Queen of Sauce recipe, and traveling merchant. So useful. Greetings, it is I, the Queen of Sauce, here to teach you a new mouth-watering recipe from my secret cookbook. This week's dish. Coleslaw, envisioning bland mounds of limp cabbage, you're not alone. But a great coleslaw can be so much more. Make sure you have fresh cabbage for this one. Toss with a little vinegar and mayonnaise and you're all set. Ah, that's crisp. Okay, so I don't know how unpopular this is, but I don't like coleslaw. So much more pleasant to watch now that it's not so yellow. Yeah, I do like the color palette a lot more. I'll give you that. Cause... I've, I've had one coleslaw that I enjoyed. 
And it was because it didn't have mayonnaise in it. It was like this apple coleslaw. So it wasn't made out of cabbage. It was made out of apple and... I forgot what else. Maybe it might have had a little cabbage, but... It, it didn't have any mayonnaise in it, and it was just crunchy. And it tasted... I don't know, like, I, I wouldn't say sour, but like... It was nice before I had it. But other than that, every other time, it's it's a no for me. Uh, do I need to take anything else to Gumpa? I guess I'll bring this with me. Uh, I also got a diamond very early as well. Haley, I guess, can just get a daffodil. That's fine. So I'll give her one of these. I'll take two. I'll take a leak for George. Uh, I mean, uh, not really gonna run into Maru, so I don't, I don't think so. Okay. I think I'm good. Oh, I put water and can back. Kind of sounded like what you called pizza salad there. What's in pizza salad? It definitely wasn't a coleslaw, but I think from a texture point of view, like how it looks, that's probably why they called it that, but it, it definitely wasn't like it in terms of taste. Uh, do, do you want something? I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Hey that's good to see ya. Feel free to visit us anytime you please. The only thing about this is I'm kind of flying blind with some of the extra characters because I don't know what they like. It's like an acidic coleslaw, no mayo, just crisp, almost pickled, textured cabbage slash kale. It, yeah, I mean, it, it sounds very similar. Ooh, that's kind of... Oh, but I don't have the money. That would have been tempting. But well, that does sound nice. But why... Why pizza, though, of all things? That's, I guess, my follow-up question. Is he in here? No. Did I get a super easy community center? Uh, I'll let you be the judge of it. I mean... These... The quality is normal. And everything else is normal, right? The garden bundle is flowers, which I should probably jump on. And then... Those are pretty standard. For fish, I got this, which is... It's fine, it's... I, I just have to catch some stuff twice. So... I don't know. Maybe? Pizza salad, because all the pizza places offer it here as a small side. Interesting. They don't really- I don't, can't really say they do salads at pizza places here. Usually here, um, the sides they offer, uh, garlic bread, chicken wings, uh, ribs. They're- they're pretty typical. Sometimes, like, lasagna or pa a pasta, maybe? I've never seen- uh, there was one place I went to, actually, that had salad, but you could barely call it a salad. The place is closed now, but it's like as if 
the person in the kitchen got an order of salad. And then it's like, okay. Yeah, what you need to do, you need to get four whole lettuce leaves. Yeah, just put four whole lettuce leaves. Then get a tomato, cut it into quarters, yeah? Then get a cucumber and just make slices like two centimeters thick. Put four pieces in there. And then just put a bunch of olive oil and uh, salad dressing and call it a day. It was, it was so bad. <laughs> just... Wasn't very good. Okay, where is she? She is currently... Okay, she's sitting in the park. Yeah, I mean, I guess if you want to be healthy, sure. But I mean, it's fast food. A lot of the time, it's like... Losing battle. Getting a salad. And yes, I've already found these two dolls. Then you have work to do. It's just the side. Yeah, but... I mean... I'll have pizza with garlic bread. No salad. So wait, you gave me an image here. Yeah, I mean... It kind of looked like that. I think pretty close. That's just too much bread. Yeah, but garlic... I mean, you have one, one or two slices of it. It's nice. Otherwise, like, chicken wings or ribs. I mean, isn't, isn't that good? Yeah, I don't know. Okay, uh... Okay, I mean, that's well, something. Yeah, okay, so for context, it's salad that you have with a pizza, not a salad made out of pizza. Which... Yeah, English is great, isn't it? <laughs> Just... Like, Kat's just doing the literal translation, I, I'm sure. Uh, hello. Is... Should I be making friends with this guy, or is it just... I shouldn't. I really don't want to work today, but Morris and I... Or, Morris said I have to. That's what it's called? I know, but, like, when you put it over to English, it just sound like, it can mean... Like, when you say potato salad, right? You don't say that it's salad that you have with potatoes. It's a salad made out of potatoes. So when you hear the word pizza salad, you would think that it's a salad made out of pizza. Or, like, pizza-like stuff. I know that's what it's called. I'm just saying, when you translate it over to English, English is stupid. That's all. Uh, hi. 
Nice day today. Need a red mushroom. Uh, probably can't get that. She's moved, hasn't she? No, okay, she's still there. Okay, uh, hap. Damn, that rose her friendship very quickly. My sister is so weird, sometimes I wonder if we're actually related. Okay, uh, where is... I'm guessing she's at home. It glitches when... When she's at home. I'm pursuing Sophia because she's like one of the new characters and the alternative is... The rich lady or the one that works at the supermarket. Wait, ugh, damn it, I went the wrong way. I mean, it just looks like an apple slaw to me. This trail train of conversation happened because coleslaw was is the daily recipe, and I said I, I didn't like it. And then I've said the only coleslaw I had was like this apple coleslaw. Oh, hello there. Um, can I help you? Present. Yeah, sweet. Thanks. Still no rise in friendship. Okay, I think that's all I wanted to do, so... I don't have much energy left. It's not apples. I know, I'm saying the one I had had apples, and then... Afterwards, you shared this one. Because I described it as something... A, a coleslaw that didn't have mayonnaise in it. I'm not saying the one that you linked has... Man, has apples, jeez. I was put off by Coleslaw at a young age as well, cause... I remember once, um, my aunt got KFC for us, and she served us a plate, and she loves coleslaw. So she puts the coleslaw on the plate, and we're like, what's this? And she's like, try it, you'll love it. And me and my brother tried it, and it was horrible. It was like runny, watery cabbage, and I, I was adverse to it for the longest amount of time. But then I tried it again as an adult, and I was like, yeah, this isn't for me. I think the salad that I enjoy the most is, um, this one that my mom makes that's like a Salvadorian salad. It's called Chimol. Um, let me tell you what it's made out of. But you typically have it with barbecued meats, and it's... It's made out of radish... Diced tomatoes, cilantro, red onion, and lemon juice and salt. And then you add, uh, like, chili to, I guess, your liking to it. So you can have it spicy or non-spicy. But it's, like, super fresh, and then you have it with, uh, with meat. It complements it pretty well.
Uh oh, I may have overdone it. We'll see. It's pretty easy to make. And I recommend it. If you want something healthy and it doesn't involve lettuce. It's pretty flavorful. I guess the only catch is you have to like cilantro, which is like a 50-50 chance. Because half the population <laughs> doesn't like it and the other half does. But other than that, it's pretty good. I'm busy, can't you tell? Yeah, okay. I wasn't very productive today. Hello, I hope your new farming life is panning out as you'd hoped. She's out of it. I think we're almost at the point where I can start skipping dialogue because it's uh, starting to get repetitive. Hi, warrior. Do you raise your sheep in your barn? You can turn their wool into beautiful bolts of cloth. Is that really how they refer to it? Elliot's hair is beautiful. What, bee chipster? Okay, there's no one else here. That's like, uh, yeah, very Melbourne hipster vibes. Just everything down to a T. Is there anything I have here to turn in? Mm, no, okay. Do I have long hair? No. My hair is very thick, it just gets very, uh, annoying. If I was to let it grow out, it would be like... It starts looking like drug dealer hair, I know that's a bad thing to say, but, you know, Central American smuggling drug hair. That's what I have. Starts looking like, oh, uh, some revolutionary or something. <laughs> Someone was throwing rocks at my tent last night, just had to wait it out. He always talks about people doing this shit to him, but you never really see who it is. Like, who does this to you? Who from this town would be the one throwing rocks at Linus? If you had to pick from a list of suspects, who would it be? I mean, he said it happened during the night, so I don't know, I would rule out the little kids. Uh, yeah, put this away. The rest can be sold. Bream. That's not bundle, it would tell me, right? What? Wasn't Bream in a bundle, or am I imagining it? Yeah, there it is, okay. Then I already- I have no use for Bream except later, but... For now, I, I need money. Um, okay, I already got that one. I just try to make sure I have at least one of every fish. On hand. Okay.
not a whole lot of money. Can hover over items in the industry and the... Oh yeah, the... This will flash. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, so, oh yeah, so see, this is handy. Olivia. Um, I have no idea what she likes, so if I stick to the generic, give her a dandelion, it should be fine. I know not everyone likes one. Hello, dear. I know you're just getting started as a gardener, so I wanted to give you a little tip. Most crops only grow in one season. When summer arrives, your spring crops will die out, so plan ahead. Okay. I need to grow flowers. Because I have a flower bundle. I don't usually grow flowers. just on the side there waiting to be pet. The amount of effort required for this will reduce very soon. Oh, that's already done. I guess I'll just... Sophia sells sprinklers, not cheap. Yeah, I think I'm okay with not using sprinklers. I think as far as money spending goes, the priority would be to get the backpack upgrade first. And then after that, probably tools. It's nice that she sells them, but... I feel like... The other stuff is more important, I don't know. Uh... Right, so it's not needed, so I can just sell it. As long as I ship... Five of them, I think is the rule. For completionism. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go buy some flowers and some more kale. Oh yeah, present. Um, where is it? Is it 15? Oh. Well. Does that include rice? I forgot how rice works. Like, do you have to just sell the unmilled rice? Mm. 
Let me see. You don't know. Yeah. <laughs> That's fine. Um, I mean, eh, I'll just sell the rice. If it's 15, fine. Better safe than sorry. Oh, cool. Right, and this is going to kill my entire day. Which I suppose is fine, I don't really have energy anyway, so... Uh, where is she? I would assume she's in her house if she doesn't appear on the map. That's the one thing about the location thing, is it just, it doesn't work for the new characters. Yeah. Okay, please like this. Oh, it's for my birthday? Thanks. Oh, she didn't like it. <laughs> she hated it. I wonder if any of Victor's friends want a part-time job cleaning the house. It'd save me a lot of time. Yeah, pass. So wait a minute, I I can pursue Victor's mom. There are eight bridges in Stardew Valley, over half of those are in Pelican Town. There are also many small wood makeshift bridges, such as the one at the beach. So hang on, wait. Wait a minute. Victor is single. And so is his mother. So, is there a scenario where you can date both of them? Like, how fucked up would that be? <laughs> right? I, I think you can. Because there was a scenario where you can date everyone in the game. I mean, they're rich. Like, I guess they can be weird. Hey, farmer. Hey, look, it's Sam. I'm just taking the melon seeds. <laughs> I don't care about the other one. I can stay there. Um, you're over, Sam. Oh, okay. I just remember you chasing down Sam and yelling every time you'd see him. Sam! Um... Okay, before I waste my time, Cat... Are there berries on, on this side of the map, or should I just not bother? I'll escape. I'm gonna get a bottle of water. Give me a sec. There's no berries? Alright, cool. Okay. Ugh, I gotta... Gotta remain hydrated during summer. Admittedly, it's not that hot here.
Oh, hey, taking a break from work? Yeah, sort of. I mean, I like that there's a new family, but I feel like their house is just way too big. <laughs> it's just... It's bigger than the community center. It just stretches out too much, I don't know. It doesn't seem correct for its scale. Whenever I'm struggling with a technical problem, I always take a walk. That's a pretty good idea to do. Sometimes I used to do that as well. I'd be like, nah, can't figure it out. I'm going to walk away from this for a while. It does work. I've only gotten three. I guess this is just to learn where they are now. Oh, that's just to the boat. Okay. I've had a couple close calls already because of the extra distance I have to travel from the mines. I sort of had it down to muscle memory and now that's gone. And because it's also a new farm map, I, I don't even have that memorized either. So when I'm coming down this stretch, sometimes I get lost. I think I need to put torches out to kind of point out the path home. Like this zigzag, this is what gets me. Is it just me or are there less bushes for salmon berry now? You passed out the entire spring because you kept going too far into the woods or on the left or the mines. <laughs> I did. That's going to happen to me. I can see it. I don't have a good grasp of uh, time yet. Jeez, can you imagine multiplayer where the game doesn't pause? Like, that would suck. It was already bad enough with the damn desert caverns just trying to make it home in time. And the stupid bus animation counted. You'd hop on the bus and then the, the clock would still keep going. That annoyed me so much. Okay, I'm going back. There's, there's clearly nothing here. I mean, this is cool and all, but it's, it's just empty. And unskippable cutscenes. Yeah, that too. And sometimes you'd get home and then you wouldn't be able to get into bed because your path would be blocked. But it's weird, I've only ever seen that in multiplayer. Oh, come on! 
What do you think? Get over here. There we go. I don't think this was worth it. Like, I've only got an 11. I feel like I used to get way more. Is it just because what used to be on this path that would have berries is now gone? It seems like there's way less to collect now. Oh, there's another. I just suck. Okay, well, what could I be doing then to improve this collection, huh? What have I done that could use improvement? What path should I take? Where have I missed? Okay, so it's safe to say that the new areas don't have any. So just not bother with them. Because I have not seen a single one in any of these new areas. So just avoid them. I work most of the cashier shifts at Jojima. It's a pretty easy job. I don't even know where she lives. She's just kind of around. Some days there are more or less berries. No, that is true, but... Even, even with that... Like, 12? Really? She lives in the city. Oh, okay. Hey! <laughs> let, me, let me through. Guess that makes sense. And uh, she walks to the bus. Okay. Man, that would suck. Taking the bus like that late at night. To work a supermarket job. Ugh. Okay. Uh, I have a little bit of energy. Tree is cut. And... What? <laughs> oh, come on, really? No. They're stuck there. No, come on. <laughs> I can't get them. I just have... To... Okay, fine. I just have these logs now, just in the way. And they're gonna remain there now? I'm pretty sure uh, I can't do anything about it. So, that, that's cool. What did I do? I just cut down a tree, and the tree fell over. And then the wood just dropped, like, normal. Oh, it's gone. Good. And it just glitched there. I, I couldn't get it. Anyway. Yay, cookies. Dear neighbor, I hope you're feeling settled in your new home. I am writing to you to let you know that Pierre's store is now selling fertilizers. Why don't you swing by and see if you can afford a few dozen boxes or so? Okay.
I love that level up sound. Ta-da! Okay, I gotta go buy seeds today. I neglected to yesterday because of the salmon berry thing. So these don't count as crops, but I need to ship at least one of each, so... Um, didn't get any gold star on that. Just ship the silver. Da, 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 done. Um, okay. I mean, do I ever do anything when that stuff happens to me in games? I, I'm just pl I'm just playing the game. Um, I never do anything specific. I'm just playing the game and that stuff happens to me. Oops. I will buy a little bit of fertilizer just to ensure the parsnips grow to gold for that bundle. Like maybe, maybe like 10. I guess it depends what I have money for. I'm not going to have any energy to do anything. Okay, well, that's done. Oh wait, I have cookies. I guess I can eat the cookies. Alright, that works. It's convenient. Um... Okay, so I do have some of this. Do I need to do anything else today? Hang on, how's presents looking? Alright, presents for Sophia. Take that. Okay. I'll just walk by there and then probably get salmon berry. Early days in Stardew are just very stressful because there's so much you want to do, but then you just don't finish it in time. And that problem just gets worse with multiplayer <laughs> because time doesn't stop. So when you're in menus doing stuff, it's like, you need to hurry up. You can't take 30 seconds to make a decision because that's like a lot of in-game time. Wait, what? Oh, there it is. <laughs> I thought it vanished. Okay, well, this is going better. This already has way more than yesterday. Oh. Um. 
I've already got about the same as yesterday in the first minute. <laughs> I did nothing wrong yesterday. Present. What do you want? Okay, we've increased friendship level. I think that's enough for the dance, right? Just green. Don't mind my husband, George. He isn't very friendly to strangers. Oh yeah, I know this, this, this dialogue. That's fine. Leave it. Looking to dissect parsnip. Delivered to Demetrius. Alright, easy. Oh damn it, don't tell me he's here. Welcome to Piers, how can I help you? Come and get it, folks, for 50% off your purchase at Jojo Mart. 50%? Well, any takers? But I can't match those prices, I'd be selling them at a loss. It must be so difficult for you to lose your loyal customers like that. But can you blame them? Georgia Corporation is clearly the superior choice. Soon the whole town will realize that. Oh, she's in there too. She's meditating. I do all my grocery shopping here. Wait, didn't... wasn't... Was he in the cutscene? Did he not, not just leave? <laughs> anyway. Um, that gets us to 20. Hold on. Is Jazz part of it? I, I should double check. There. Ugh, I always mix it up. Uh, pantry, artisan, crops, full, garden, that's the one. Blue jazz, okay it is. Tulip, summer spangle, pharaoh, sunflower, okay. There's... Let's just say three of each. Um, get more potato. I can only manage this. It's like, that's it. That's all I can do with that. Okay. I don't have enough for the soil, so I'm just going to gamble it. Oh, yeah. I should probably talk to everyone. Breathe in, breathe out. Money smiles at you through a mist of sweat. Exercising can be fun. My arms are strong, but my legs need work. Don't look, I'm all red and sweaty. Olivia is concentrating on her yoga form. Okay. It's a silly question. Why did they have the campfire going if they're exercising and we're in spring? 
I mean, the third, whatever, you know what I mean. Like, why would you do exercise in front of a fire like that <laughs> in spring? During the day or night, it's daytime. I wonder if any nice shells washed up on the beach this morning. Present. I just noticed that they're, they're all doing exercise in front of a roaring fire. Like, what, what do you mean? <laughs> Early spring can still be cold enough for that not to be insane, but even here that's a bit much. But, okay, I mean, I guess this take- where does this take place? Wherever salmon berries grow in America, that's where it takes place. I'm sure you two could become good friends one day, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know, like, in spring surely the heat of your exercise would keep you warm, no? I sell different dishes each week, so make sure to check in every now and then. Like, am I... Why, why would you want to do exercise in front of a roaring fire? In spring. Mom won't let me have any more gummies today. I'm tutoring Vincent and Jazz today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. I think we're at the point where now... Um... I've read it all for this season, so. Oh, hi, hi. It's good to see you again. Take it easy. There are hot room exercises in front of a roaring fire. Ugh, I need... To go to Pierre's for groceries soon. I don't know why my mother doesn't just hire a butler already. Hey, are you thinking of a part-time job? Oh, that was rude, wasn't it? Apologies, Wari. I lost my composure. This kid's just spoiled. He has Super Saiyan hair. Yeah, I can see that. Not a fire, but a sauna. Oh, no, I've, I've heard of sauna being therapeutic. I, I get that, but... That's a roaring fire there. I went in a sauna once. Did not enjoy it. I don't know, just getting, getting that sweaty. Okay, um, I have some other stuff I can plant. Okay, so I'm, I'm one off. I, I don't care. It's fine. I can plant one of the other ones later. Okay, I'll go up to the north path and then collect what I can and just spend the rest of the day fishing. Nice. <laughs> I'll take that. Coal is very valuable early. When I get to preserve jars, it's going to be good.
I guess yesterday was just an off day. I have found way more today. Ugh, I'm not in a good mood right now. I said I'm not in a good mood. What do you want? Okay. Don't mess with anyone that says I'm not in a good mood. I was thinking people are like stones skipping over the water. Eventually we're going to sink. Okay, Edgelord. Wow, man, that was like so meaningful. You should write a book. You should write these thoughts down. Oh. But I can't get over there. I mean, I would go try fishing at the, the other bridge, but I feel like by the time I get there, it's going to be too late. Every time I see this fish, I just get reminded of, uh, of being a kid in school and having that word banned. It's that principle I've talked about many times, the one that I, I am convinced she did not like children, but she worked in, in a school. But yeah, there was a security company called Chubb Security. And I don't remember the commercial much, but they were talking about you should own a chub alarm. So in school, because, you know, we were little kids and found anything funny that would annoy people. We just keep repeating chub alarm, chub alarm, chub alarm. So this principal got so annoyed that she banned the word chub. And it was in a long series of... Uh, things that she banned. It was basically, oh, oh, these kids are being annoying. I'm just going to ban this. Instead of being like, well, yeah, they're just children. They're just laughing at something silly. She'd hold, she'd hold and hold an assembly and make a big deal out of it. It's come to my attention that a lot of you have been saying Chabalam. So from this day forward, the word chub is now banned. Any student saying the word chub will get detention. You know, in hindsight, I can see why the word was probably banned. But still, I mean, it's just kids being kids. I don't think we we saw the nefarious meaning of the word chub. Also, right, walk home. I got I gotta remember, like, this is further away than before. Ooh. 
Oh no. I have... Uh, I should be okay. Don't get lost on the way. Don't get lost on the way. I'm going to be greedy. I need a salt. I need money for tomorrow. <laughs> okay. That's fine. Okay, um... I guess I should now go mining and try to get some of this going. Alright. What I'll do, I'll water the plants, buy a salad, and go to the mines. Yeah, to rerun. Oh, but it's still ugh, still salmon berry day. Because is this really worth it for the under twenty salmon berries I'm gonna get? Come on, there has to be one gold one here. Wow. Not a single gold one. Okay, how many do I... I think I'm good on these, right? Yeah. So I'll just leave five for cooking purposes. Just checking. I knew I forgot something. <laughs> I don't know why I play this so late at night. A time at which I should be not thinking as much. This game does make me think more than I'd like to admit. I'm still gonna go with my plan, I think. I don't know. I think with all the extra buildings I have, there's just less salmon berries. I don't think it's worth missing out on ore and stuff with just a dozen of them. Away, put that away. Um, not gonna go fishing. Not gonna cut wood. I just want more inventory space for the mines. 
Sword, pickaxe, hoe, drop this off. Okay. Damn it, he's closed on Wednesdays. Um, I can't plant stuff then. It's, it's such a large inconvenience. It's, it's no wonder that a corporation has taken his business. Of all the days as well, like I'd understand Sunday, but Wednesday, really? I may as well talk to him since they're here. Miss Penny says I have to go read this book before I can play. We don't have a school here, but I'm doing... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. We've said that before. Hey, sorry in advance if I say anything rude. I didn't get much sleep last night. What do you want? <laughs> I love that combination of dialogue. Um, I do want to purchase food, but the thing is he always gets to the counter. It says it opens at 12, but he's never at the counter at 12. Looks like a good day to play catch, huh? I just wish I had someone to play catch with. Alex is my grandson. Have I told you that already? I saw the most beautiful family of butterflies sunning themselves in the town garden yesterday. What did you say? It's 11.50 a.m. already, my goodness. Wait a minute, Demetrius. Okay, and it's parsnip. Go get- go get the parsnip. <laughs> um, what do you think the new song should be about? Uh, trains. Hey, you know what? That sounds perfect, thanks. Hmm, tax collection. <laughs> Spring festivities, expenses. <laughs> I forgot about his parsnip. Uh, yeah, I don't really have seeds, so I guess I'll just plant you. No mix seeds, no mix seeds. Okay, take that with me. Hi there, do you have everything you need for the farm? Yep. All right, I'll take, I'll take two. Should hopefully allow me to progress pretty far. Oh, crap. I should have checked where he was. Okay, he's here. <laughs> Good. Hey, brought me the item asked for. I really appreciate it. Let me see. Here's what I owe. Okay. I got some of that money back. On Tuesdays and Thursdays, I work at Harvey's clinic. He says he likes having me around in case his medical equipment goes haywire. You're probably growing a lot of interesting plants on your farm, huh? Hey there, Wario. I was just daydreaming about some new carpentry projects. Oh, 
Okay, time to go into the mines. I guess I can eat these as well. Okay, uh, go here. That's convenient. Also convenient. It's basically two floors for free. Alright, I'll plant that when I get home. For the longest amount of time, I didn't know you could interact with these. And get a bunch of coal out of them. <laughs> I missed out on so much. Nice. That's what I call lucky. Which one is it? One? Okay, it's one. Good. Consume salad. Ah! <laughs> Get away. Okay. Jeez. Thank you for the follow, stylish harmonica. Appreciate it. Game, please. There we go. Didn't drop a crab. Come on. It's, it says ugh, the day is in my hands. I'm getting harassed. Made school a little less boring. Fair enough. Wow, that really did not give me that much energy. Wait. Nice. 
Oh no, come on. <laughs> why? Why, 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 why? And now you gotta go again. Well, good. Understand. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks for popping in. <sighs> okay, maybe I'll be able to make a bug steak. Okay, a lot. Consume. Dude, what what is this? I'm gonna level up combat at this rate. Okay, I guess that's that's a positive. There we go. Um, I'm gonna go kill those bugs down there. Please tell me that's enough. It is. Okay, I mean, I guess if nothing else, although, ooh, hang on. It's 10 p.m. I might not be able to go too much further. Yes! Oh, you've got to be kidding. Okay, fine. Find an exit. Find an exit. Find an exit. Find an exit. <laughs> nah. <laughs> it's a pose. It's a pose for the best. Oh, hello. Hi. I'm not what you'd call the chatty type. I can't believe that happened. Two infestations, really? Okay, I mean, I suppose I have a bug steak to eat tomorrow, so then I have more energy after watering the plants. Uh, while I'm here... Oh, you can't like, damn it. Okay, uh, what's required for a coop? Just a sec. A hundred stone, which we've got, and then three hundred wood. So I just need to work on the three hundred wood, which we can do tomorrow. Oh, yeah, easy. It's just fifty wood. And then how much money? Four thousand gold. Alright, so then it's really the gold I gotta worry about. We got hardwood. Hang on. I'll make another bug steak. Uh. Put this to smelt overnight. Hold on. Plant this. There we go. Ah, oh, crap. It's cauliflower. <laughs> it's not gonna make it in time.
Okay, before I start the next day, give me a sec. I just need to do something very quickly. Okay, all good. <laughs> Pam's birthday. I don't think I have anything to give her. Pam starter. Daffodil. All right, that'll do. Gonna get green beans soon. gonna be a stretch, but I really don't think it's gonna give me the gold uh, parsnips. Okay, I'm gonna have to look into buying... Unless I can make it. Oh, I can make it. Okay, I'm gonna make fertilizer then. Alright, that's all my copper. Didn't that... There we go. I was gonna say, didn't that split stack? Uh, okay. 
Topaz is fine. Alright. Oh, I can make a gold bar. I guess I'll do that. Might be able to make something with it early. Okay. Uh, the, the, the... I think I can take everything else with me. Pam's birthday, daffodil, where is it? There, alright, done. Yeah, I don't know about this tree, but... This will at the very least get me the raw materials required for the coop. And then the rest is just money. Oh, that really does not do much for you. <laughs> I mean, two of them, sure. There's actually a lot of wild food in this area if you know where to look. Yeah, I mean, I suppose I should look. carrying too much stuff. I guess that first day must have been just unlucky <laughs> to only get 12. This is way better. Oh, hello. Wait, who's this? Hey, you seem a bit out of it. Is everything okay, boo? Sorry. I'm just trailing off in thought. You said the doctor prescribed you new medicine. Is it helping with... Yeah, it helps. Hey, you'll get through this. I'll visit you a hundred times, that's what it takes. You always know how to cheer me up. Who's that guy? Oh, um, that's Warrior, the new farmer I told you about.
Nice to meet you, Wario. I'm Scarlet, a friend of this dork. Getting into the farming business? It's tough work. I live in Grampleton with my gram- <laughs> I almost said Grampleton with my grandpa. With my papa. He's over at Marnie's with the truck loading up a bunch of milk and wool. We met during a cosplay meetup. Grampleton is kind of far away. I really appreciate it when she visits. Shoot. I should run back. He's probably just done by now. Oh, okay. Text me later. For sure, I'll send you something funny. It was nice meeting you, Aria. Bye, boo. Bye, you. Hey. Did you hear anything we were talking about? Oh. Yeah, sure. Be honest. Something about medicine? Yeah. Aww. Okay, sorry about earlier, I just have a lot of feelings. Um, so you met Scarlet, she doesn't visit often, we usually call each other or text. Presents... Yeah, okay. We're good. It's the rich, rich kid. Have any plans today? I think I may continue work on a project I'm in the middle of. Such as... Um, I don't know what- oh, you know what, I don't need to know. Where is Pam? Wait, what? Okay, hold on. Oh, she's at Georgia Mart. Okay. Oh no, I think my dad's going to cook dinner tonight. Can I interest you in a rock? Perhaps. Uh, Pam? You remember my birthday? I'm impressed, thanks. There you go. My house ain't pretty, but at least it's by the river. I can't say that I know much about Pelican Town. Sorry, I should be going. Hey, yeah, you're in here too. Georgia has the best and cheapest products. If I shopped at Pierre's, I'd go out of business. Georgia, oh yeah. Okay, see, so yeah, 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 yeah. I've been reading up on different strategies. Okay, he says the same thing. Okay. Wait, don't give him that. Business has been slow lately. You could upgrade your tools. I could use the cash, yeah? Maybe you're going to remain open at more convenient hours. I should... 
try to be organized about this as I'm going. I'll try to be organized as I'm going. Okay. I don't want to get yelled at. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go drop off stuff at... Ooh, seeds. I forgot about seeds. He's, he's open till six. Go, 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 go. Oh no, he's already closed. Crap. I should have come here first. Okay, well. That's my bad. Yeah, I would tell you about my thoughts, but it's a fisherman's secret. Okay. Sam. Thanks, I really like this. The clouds look great this time of year, don't they? Um, I think I'm just gonna go fishing on that bridge and try it out. I'm wasting too much time. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Nice positioning. Mushroom on the fence. Okay, let's see what this brings. Why am I finding mushrooms, though? Oh. Okay, whatever this is, it's going to be tricky to catch. Dude. Okay, so I'm guessing that's one of these special fish. Hold on. Like, this isn't a standard fishing spot, it would appear. Yeah, yeah, totally worth it, yes! Oh, yes! <laughs> okay, no, it's normal now. Somewhat. Holy crap, it's... Why, why is it not filling up quickly? Okay, that was lucky. It is a puppy fit. Is that? No. Is that real? <laughs> this is like the blobfish where I'm, I'm gonna hate.
Dog Puffer. But it's not the same thing. This is not a real thing. <laughs> oh no. Okay. And we're done here. What the heck? This fish no no wants nothing but... Okay, yeah. It's clearly... Clearly not real. Claire is edging away from me. I mean, can you blame her? It's night time. Okay, that's all dealt with. Um, need a catfish to pair with the red wine. Andy. I, I think... Well... It depends if it rains. That's 100% conditional if it rains. Which, maybe? I don't know. I won't accept it. Okay, tomorrow I have to get seeds. I'm guessing this fish is just pure, purely... Also, it sells for 350. That's a, quite a bit. Um... So stupid. But okay. I'm guessing it's purely for the aquarium just to have a dog in the aquarium. I don't know. It's worth more than a gold bar. What? And so if I go catch multiple of those things, it's like, that's broken. I need a cauliflower. Yeah, I got one already. Consider it done. Cauliflower for Jody. Done. Okay, today without failure, we are going... We are going to get seeds. I mean, right now it's not broken because I can't catch them easily, but once I get, like, a lure, that's dumb. It's like one, that was just silver quality as well. If I get a gold one, it'll be worth, like, 400 gold. It's the most efficient way to make money. Oh, it's a traveling merchant. Crap, I should probably see what it has for sale.
Okay. Getting seeds first thing. After the uh, traveling merchant. Uh, I guess I'll put these away for- no wait, keep that. That's for the bundle. I'm not forgetting anything, am I? No, okay. Garlic? Nah. Ah, oh, no. Damn it. It was on sale, but I don't have the money for it. That would have been big. Okay, I think the meta thing for me to try here is to catch more of that dogfish. If it sells for three fifty a pop, like I'd be silly not to try it. Especially if I can manage to catch two, like that's quite a bunch of money. I'm gonna try it. Uh, let me just see where Jody is. Okay, she's in the house. Excuse me, although I should probably just talk to you. Don't get tired of running around on that farm all day or whatever it is you do. I couldn't stand getting all dirty like that. Alright. Please tell me she hasn't left. Damn it, she just left. <laughs> get back here. There she is. There you go. Oh, seeds, 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 seeds. <laughs> I didn't forget. Okay. Uh... I'm just trying to get the gold standard ones. I guess maybe a few of these. I mean, I do need to get 15 of each, but I don't think that's going to happen this season. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? Alright, done. Wait, what am I doing? <laughs> Over here. Ah, oh, there's a cauliflower I need. Crap. <laughs> Crap. I thought I had already put it in. Okay. Uh, I mean, I'm gonna plant anyway, so I can come back. I'm gonna plant, I'm gonna see if I can eat something, and then I'll go fishing, so it's, it's okay, it's still fine. I think. And then with any luck I should get five gold standard ones here. Alright, I have enough for tomorrow, when all these come out. There's the cauliflower, don't forget it. 
Put this back. What can I make from a food perspective? I might be able to make a snack bar. I can. Okay, good. Then I can... I can replenish... It's okay, half, half of the day. I still got the other half of the day to fish. This is fine. Wrong one. See, that would have been useful. I'll use it next season. And now I get to see the rest of them. Uh, okay. That one's easy. Engineer's bundle. Ooh. Okay, that that's doable. All right. The iridium might be the more tricky one to get in the first year, but we'll see. It's okay. It's just clay. It's just clay. It doesn't matter. It's a bit sad, but it's just clay. Oh no, my mom's making lentil soup tonight. If you dig in the dirt, you can find some interesting things. I don't know you. So you smart kid. The other one's like, I'm going to tell you about my personal life so you know where I am. Okay. Now all I have to do, even if I catch like say only three, it's still probably more worth it than anything else. I'm relying on RNG here quite a bit. This erratic pattern. <laughs> I mean, I still get experience from fishing up trash, so it's fine. Uh, 
Come on, dude. I think this is going to be a better thing to do later when I can get it more reliably, but if I can get a couple, it's still probably more worth than fishing less valuable stuff. Dude, this is so exhausting. Nisa, there we go. There we go. When it goes towards the bottom, that's good. When it does this, not so good. Sit there for. <sighs> oh my god, this thing's so annoying. Got you, bitch. <laughs> oh, that's something else. It's butterfish. Butter. Okay. So there's more than one fish. Damn it, but ugh, no, I can't, I can't sell this. It's useless. I should get extra points for that one. Oh my god. What is this pattern? Holy crap! Oh, this is so exhausting. <laughs> this is basically like catching a legendary fish. It really is. Nah. Oh, I need a, I need a minute. Um. Ugh. It's not easy. I definitely need the, uh... The lures, I think, to make this worthwhile. But I figured it was worth a shot. I did get one. How much is this worth? Out of interest. This is worth 337. Like, one of these fish is worth quite a bit. This is so exhausting to catch them. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm at the mercy of RNG as well. Like, sometimes they'll just do that. Hey, Lolo. How's it going, dude? How's things? Thrice. 
Alright, that'll do. Going alright, can't sleep for shit. <laughs> Man. Yeah, that sucks. Uh, I'm doing okay, just kicking back. Progressing more in this. Just uh, got tricked into thinking that some of these fish are real. Okay. Everyone should still be here. Ah, 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 where are you going? Damn it, I have to go out. Okay. Don't you have work to do? Go on. You can catch me at the salon most nights. Okay. Is anyone else leaving? No, we're good. I think they're just saying the same things as last time, so... I'm just gonna skip through it. Oh, it's up to you. What do you say? Oh. It's simpler to be... Yeah, like, same thing. Here's a secret. My sister loves golden ocean flower. It's her favorite. Okay, so that's a new item. They've just retroactively added uh, some new favorite items. I think I'm going to give up on these super expensive fish. They're just too much hassle for now. But later, I think that's probably one of the best ways to make money. I had to look up whether or not this was a real fish. <laughs> I'm not going to look up this one because clearly there's no way that either of these two are real. It's Shane's birthday, which I can default to get him a beer, but I don't know if I want to spend the money. I'll see what else I can do. Okay, there's another gold one. That's two gold ones. Okay, uh, put the gold one in. So I just need two more. And these can be sold. Okay. With any luck, these will yield me gold. Oh, I have one spare spot. Uh, do I have anything I can plant? I guess I technically have to craft one set of... Okay, uh, what is it? Horseradish, leek, dandelion, that. I have to craft one set of these, so I may as well... How long does it take?
Seven dice, alright, that's fine. That'll do. A butterfish is technically a thing. It doesn't look like a stick of butter, though. Okay. I wonder if it's based off that. I mean, I looked up the uh, puppy fish. It doesn't look like... There's something that is similar, but it's not called that, so I don't know. Oh, well, that just... Alright, next season. This is bad timing. I need to go make some money today. Why do they call it a butterfish out of interest? Does any particular reason? Okay, uh, let's put that away. I guess we're good to go. I think I'm just gonna do normal fishing. Right, what am I getting, Shane? Likes pizza. Can purchase a pizza. Likes all eggs, all fruit, except hot pepper. I don't have any fruit. Don't have any eggs. What's Universal Likes? Universal Likes. All artisan and goods, all cooking, all flowers, except for poppy. All forage minerals, except for quartz. Alright, we'll just give them that, I think. What about beans? What do you mean? He doesn't like beans. Oh, the cat. <laughs> yeah, but like... Ah. I thought you- I thought you- I thought you were talking about just what to give Shane. <laughs> yeah, I guess I can keep that to make clothing. How's it going, Victor? Um, he's on his way to work, right? What? 
Where is he? Oh, he's still there. Okay. It's easy. You smell like grass. This is such a small town, you can't avoid meeting everyone. Dad's coming back soon. I hope he brings me some toys. It's called a butterfish because it has a delicate buttery taste. Right. I just remembered that I was meaning to do something, but I forgot. It's one of those things where I'm sure it's as dumb as uh, when people say that stuff tastes like chicken, you know, when it doesn't really. Wah! Wah? Who said wah? That's my line. <laughs> Wario. I got lost in the woods chasing a squirrel. Can you take me back to Aunt Marnie's? Eh, hey, what you doing? How about you say something other than wah and then I'll take you back. Okay. Sure, but you need- so, the, uh, the option is yes or yes. Thanks, Wario. Okay, uh, follow me. <laughs> oh my goodness, Jazz, are you okay? I was about to go looking for you. I got lost in the forest. Wario found me. Let's get inside. I'll cook your favorite meal, okay? Thank you, Wario. Eh? How about you offer Wario some of that food, eh? <laughs> Yo, steal her peas. I tried. It, it doesn't work. Not not possible, unfortunately. He's not here, is he? He's not here. It's cutscene. Where is he? Crap. <laughs> like two ships in the night. Did I want Nah as an option? <laughs> I mean. Like, she was the one that was like, she didn't know me. Oh, so now you know me. Now when it's beneficial to you, now you know me. Now, now I'm not a stranger. So far, every interaction with her has been, I don't know you. Little shit. I'm kidding, of course. But, you know, if Wario would, would say something like that. Wait, where is he? Oh, he's at the doctor's office. No, he's there. He's in the corner. Okay, there you go. If you want to play a cruel drone command, give her a monster mushroom. She might not forgive you, though. The heck is a monster mushroom? Need a dandy... Okay. Okay. I just happened to have one. Is it just me or does Abigail have an unhealthy interest in doom and gloom? Maybe I'm just too old to understand. That's Shane in the corner. <laughs> I knew exactly where that was going. You missed the line. That's Shane in the spotlight. You missed the line. I was about to say it. I'm not gonna lie, I was about to say it. Yeah. 
If the local fishing scene got a bit more lively, I might expand the shop stock. Hey, that's me in the corner. That's me in the spotlight. Eh? Uh, that's how the song goes. Please tell me he's here. Oh, wait, what? What is this? Be aware, you are standing above a potent magical field. Ah, the item I requested. Your work is satisfactory. Here's your compensation. I built my hut here on purpose, you know. Everyone, like, goes for Abigail because she plays games. I think it's kind of cool that she murders an, a monster for you as well. But yeah, I typically go for the ones that have some sort of nerdy thing going, whether it's gaming, art, reading, science. In this circumstance, I guess going to... Going to the new ones, like... Well, who was it a choice between? It was like... So it's her, Sophia. And then... Where is she? The one that works at Jojo Mart. And then... Olivia. Rich, rich mother. I find it weird that you can date the mother and the son. Wait, she's not here. She's probably in here. Nope. Where is she? Well, it says it's unknown where she is, so I don't know. Probably somewhere new on the map. I, I don't want to go looking. Because correct me if I'm wrong, you can end up with a scenario where you can date everyone at the same time, right? And there's a, spe a specific cutscene for getting busted dating everyone. So you can end up in a scenario where you can date a mother and a son. If you really wanted to. Um, so I mean, Sophia is just shy and it looks like we had a cutscene where... She talks about some medication that's been helping her, so I imagine she has, like, some anxiety issues or something along those lines. It's yet to be revealed, but... Based on the interactions so far. Um... The rich mother used to work corporate, moved here, and now does, like, trading or something every now and then. And her son is... seems like a... A rich kid, because she keep he keeps asking about um getting a butler. Uh, the one that works at the supermarket, she hasn't really opened up, but I guess we haven't gotten to know her much, so that's understandable. I feel like I'm missing someone. Who am I missing? This mod is cool, but I think it's still a work in progress. Is there some areas that seem a bit empty? I think my favorite interaction with the supermarket girl was just walking home. 
and I try to say hi, and then it says that she backed away from me, and it's just like, oh, Wario approaches her at night. Hey, what are you scared about? Just wanted to say hi, hey? Oh, come on. What is wrong with this? We've hit level 5, though, so I got to pick a passive. Dude. Okay, here's, a, here's like a question I have from earlier. Just to see how widespread this is. But pizza places, do they do salads where you are? Because it's not really a thing here. I've been to one pizza place that did a salad and it was horrible. It was like, they took five large pieces of like lettuce leaves and then they got a, t a tomato and cut it in four. And then got some cucumber and it was like... Each slice was about a centimeter thick. You don't really order out often, but you've never seen it. Okay. I mean, here the... Options are garlic bread, wings, um, ribs, and then there's like Domino's and Pizza Hut, which do like a bunch of other stuff, but not a salad. I mean, like restaurants have that other stuff, yeah. I mean, Kat was showing something that was literally called pizza salad. Which is like, it looks like a coleslaw almost, but not really. You've been to some places that do a simple salad or two, but mostly they do pasta and breadsticks. Yeah, pasta's the other one, but it's less common. You, you would definitely get pasta before you would find salad on the menu. Maybe it's just a Swedish thing. Okay, one more and then I should walk back. They do bananas on their pizzas over there. God knows what other stuff they are up to. <laughs> I mean... I thought it would have been something common to the region. Judge is a superior choice to Pierre's. Yeah, 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 yeah. Herring. Do we have a herring? I think that's used in a thing, so we'll get one. Anchovy. We don't have one. You're not the right pass, it's in task. No, it's fine. 
I mean, just curiosity. More than anything else. Is that a dogfish? Yeah, I mean, I had to look up if it was real, but... I think this is just purely to have a dog in a fish tank. <laughs> More than anything else. It's also stupidly difficult to catch it, but I got one. Okay, I think I need to make another chest. I'm gonna start putting other stuff in here, like... Seeds. I mean, these technically count as seeds. Okay, now we, we're good. I hope I watered everything. Hey, <laughs> let me go to sleep. Okay. Uh, yeah, always fish worth more. This is the one downside to having a pet in this game, is sometimes it will stand in the doorway and can cause you to not get to bed in time. <laughs> Greetings, it is I, the Queen of Swords, here to teach you a new mouth-watering recipe from my secret cookbook. This week's dish, radish salad. There's nothing like a fresh peppery radish, it reminds me of the late spring. My mother would slice up our fresh radishes and serve them on grainy bread with a little salt and pepper. Ah, those were the days, but I digress. You learn how to cook radish salad. Listen, if you want a better version of radish salad, you should try the Salvadorian um, salad. It's called chimol, and it's made out of chopped radishes diced finely, tomatoes chopped finely, about an equal ratio of both, some cilantro that's coarsely chopped, and then finely chopped red onion, so it's like about the same as the uh, radish and tomato chunks. And then some lemon juice, some salt, and uh, if you really want to, want to, you put like some chilies in there just to spice it up, and it's great. Have it with some barbecued meat. At least I don't place all the furniture there. Yeah, you know. A multiplayer issue that I have to deal with is just the furniture just somehow blocking my entry. I don't know how the game does that. Too far, my warrior. Aunt Marie said I needed to write a thank you letter. So, thanks for finding me in the forest and taking me back home. I won't go that far in the forest again. That's, uh, that's very polite. I still can't believe I'm going to get ancient fruit that early. Like, that was quite the find. Magically appearing at the front door, yeah.
I'm hoping that what like surely there's there's two gold ones in here. Okay, before I forget and get yelled at. All my energy, practically. Okay. Traveling Merchant Day. Okay. Beans is the protagonist of the story, for sure. I mean... Kind of typical of a warrior game for Wario to kind of... Be a secondary focus unintentionally. Like, by some cruel fate, Wario will make millions on this farm, and then, due to, like, a legal loophole, his cat will inherit everything. And he'll just go back to being poor. So they have changed the shop window art, haven't they? I thought they had. Hey, it's good to see you. Feel free to visit us anytime. Okay, um... Right, I need to... I think I need to start getting tappers going. Is that the thought of the traveling merchant? I don't know. It sounds like the plot of the Aristocats all over again. That's why I said it. That's just something that would be... You know it would happen for a Wario game. I forgot to bring her a present, but I'll just say hi. Assuming she's around. She's not, huh? I don't know where she hangs out. Oh, it's Leo. So it's got new cutscenes, that's cool. Wario, hello. It's a lovely day today. I dropped by to check on my green beans, and they're ready to harvest. Gus and Pierre were here a little while ago, taking care of their crops too. Pelican Town's community garden is pretty nifty, wouldn't you agree, Wario? It's cute, but my farm can hold 40 times more. <laughs> that is- if, if this was Wario, that would- that would be... His response. Bah, who cares? My my farm can hold forty times more than this. Oh yes. <laughs> anyway. Yes, it's spectacular. I'm very thankful for this community garden. I don't have much property to grow. My own food. But thanks to this little plot of land we all share, I can. Phew, that's all of them. Now I need to decide what to cook with these tonight. There's a fresh he oh, here's a fresh green bean straight from the vine. Oh, but... And you know what, I guess that's nice because it refills my energy, good. Fine. I'll- I'll take that. 
Oh wait, I got to keep it anyway. Bonus. I've been mayor of Pelican Town for over 20 years. Yeah, he's gonna like pat himself on the back. <laughs> mm, raw green bean. Hey, listen, there are some people that do that, okay? Just like how they'll take a tomato off the vine and just eat it. I can't, I can't do that. I, I can't bring myself to do that. Okay, this might seem odd, but I know there's, there are other people that are like this, but I'm very weird when it comes to tomato. Like, I'll, uh, I can never eat them whole, right? So something like cherry tomatoes, nah. But if it's sun-dried, however, I will- I can, because it's technically a whole one, but I don't perceive it as a whole one. And then if I'm gonna ha if I'm going to have tomato in, say, a burger, a slice, it has to be pretty thinly sliced. Like, I hate thick sliced tomato in a burger. The burger places that are legit have a good tomato slice ratio to cheese. I hate fast food burgers because they just have these extra, extra thick tomato slices. I hate them. They have to be thin. Not super thin. There's, there's a special middle ground where it's just like the correct ratio. Cherries, tomatoes, slap, 10 out of 10 snack. Nah. I don't know, man. It's just, it's just a texture thing. But I know there are a lot of people like that. Like, I'm not alone in this. It's a ratio thing at the end of the day, I think, but... I don't know, there's just something about extra thick cut tomato that it just... It feels like it overpowers things. If I had a Caprese salad. I- I have. Um... I've also kind of had, like, bruschetta. But again, they've done thin slices. It's like a ratio thing where it's like... The perfect amount of cheese to tomato to, like, olive oil ratio. Again, like, I'm not saying I won't have it. It's just to me, it comes down to the thickness. I just got another ancient seed. <laughs> I can... I can make another... Wow. Two ancient seeds in the first season. Mental. <laughs> For that dish, you would agree 100%. The whole point of that dish is, is the correct ratio. And that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm like with not that dish, but like if I'm having cut tomato in general is... I can't have it on its own, and if it's going to be with something, it has to be in, a, in the correct ratio. Like, dude, with some fast food places, the tomato slice is thicker than the meat cut. And that's not right. That's all I'm saying. It just, it's not good. I'm not saying that, like, I wouldn't have a burger with a tomato slice in it. I would, if the ratio and thickness is correct. You didn't realize I meant that thick. I mean, I don't know, like... If I look at McDonald's and uh, the equivalent of Burger King here... Yeah, I would say, like, uh... The tomato slices are roughly as thick as the burger patty. And I think that's- that's not good. 
It sounds like subpar knife work. It's not knife work, they use a machine. I've worked at, uh... I mean, the first job I had was in fast food, right? And I know... It's just this slicer thing, and they just put a tomato in, and then just... You push it forward, and it slices everything. So... Yeah, they they don't hand cut. That's that's just too inefficient in terms of time. But this thing is kind of set to that size, so you can't really alter it. They need to change the slice setting. Well, the one I remember the one that we used to use, it didn't have a setting. Maybe it had a different blade, but yeah, I don't know. It was designed to slice tomatoes. That was its function. It wasn't for me. Like, this was something specifically designed to do tomato slices for burgers from memory. I know other places have have this thing. Maybe it's just a, thi a here thing. I don't know. Excellent. Oh, yes! Okay. I found a pair of sneakers as well. Good stuff. A glow ring as well. Nice. Okay, let me see if I can catch this fish since I'm here. And they're very good to have a pond with this fish early on. I'm surprised. I, I would have thought someone would have been like, oh yeah, no, I don't like tomato that thick either. But I believe me, I have met people that say the same thing. You don't like tomatoes at all. Okay, well, that's fine. I'm just very particular with, yeah, cut tomatoes. And I can't eat a whole one. You do eat tomato sauce. Okay, so you're like my brother. My brother had that for the longest amount of time. Would not have anything with, like, tomato that wasn't in sauce form. And even with that, he was very particular. Like, didn't like tomato sauce, but would have pasta with a tomato sauce in it. And, uh, he didn't try a burger until, oh man, how old, he, he was in his 20s. Like, tried to give him burgers as a kid, didn't eat it, and then when it came to being a teenager, he just wouldn't have it, basically. He'd go get something else. And then one day out of the blue, I just get this photo, and he's eating a burger out of nowhere, it's just like, I, I, tripped balls. It's like, wow. It was in part because of the tomato slice, but yeah, I don't know. People say you can just take the tomato run, but it drips and runs on everything. Yeah, that's... that was his reasoning as well. And I used to be like, well, just order a burger without one, and then he'd still be like, no. Like, why don't, why don't you get a chicken one? The chicken ones usually are just lettuce, mayo, and chicken. Your roommate is like that too. He's fine with ketchup and tomato pasta sauce, but then he's not okay with salsa. Yeah. It's just one of those things that something gets into your mind as a kid and it's just, it's hard to stray away from it. Crap. Um, get rid of the fiber.
I gotta be careful because it's further away now. I mean, I thought that was the case with me and eggplant, but then, to my surprise, as an adult, I accidentally had it and was sick. <laughs> so. I can't believe I got another ancient seed. <laughs> oh, man. Still ghost fish. You agree of picking us to you hate everything. Oh, I was pretty open when it came to food. Not ex not like I'm not gonna say I was extremely open to food, but m more open than most kids. I particularly liked Asian food, it was really good. Oh, come on, man. Um, it's 11.40, I have to go. It's okay, I can always come back here. I gotta remember that this is further away now. How'd I do on the aura front? I only got 14. Wow, that's nothing. But probably enough to do a tapper. Um, is there anything I can ditch? Not particularly. Alright. Oh, this is so much better now with this ring. Oh, you know what I should do? Get a head start on that. Okay. It's not used in bundles, right? No. Okay. So let's put this one here, and let's sell the two gold ones. Keep the algae, because that's used in soup. Sell the bean. Okay. Get in bed. How do I feel about awful? Uh... I mean... I don't know. In general, don't really eat it, but... I have, uh... An uncle who's Peruvian, and they have quite a few dishes that involve awful. I've had one in particular that it was alright, and I didn't know what it was, so... That's kind of how I tried it, but in general, yeah, probably not. But then again, I probably have it with, uh, like, meat pies here in Australia. They probably use some of that in some of the cheaper brands. So probably for some school lunches, I, I more or less had it. But in general, no, probably not.
At a restaurant, you have some awful choices which you haven't tried yet. You're a little intimidated. I mean, as I've, I've had it now, and it's one of those things that, if prepared correctly, I think you won't even notice what it is. It's one of those things that just came from necessity and not wasting an animal that, you know, gave its life. But yeah, nah. And I'll I'll generally not do it. Okay, uh, let me chuck down a speed grow. Oh wait, it's here now. Bask in the glory of my two ancient seeds. <laughs> I don't know. There's some things that... I'm sure they taste fine, but I don't see the necessity in trying them. You know what I mean? Like, uh... Okay. Like, for example... There's, uh, the... Damn it, I always forget the name of it, but you know the, the thing they do in Southeast Asia with the embryo? The chicken embryo? Balut, or whatever it's called? I forget the name. Like, that thing. Nah. And then there's, uh, Sustroming, like, I'm sure, I'm sure it tastes fine, but it's something that I don't see the necessity in trying. It just, I don't know, man. Okay, I need to sell more of these. It's also like, uh, durian. Durian is one of those things where it is it is quite literally a 50-50 gamble. Some people will smell a delicious fruit. Some people will smell rotting flesh. <laughs> or gas. I don't know, I feel like those aren't odds I want to take. So, there's quite a few things where... I'm sure that- I'm sure there's a reason and I'm sure they taste well. Like, some of it might have been out of necessity. Some of it could be that it's just a culinary thing where, yeah, it, it's cool. And it probably tastes good, but I just, I don't know, man. I think I can go my life without trying it. We tried to try a balut once because you had some Filipino friends back home. You gagged and they laugh at you. Yeah. Yeah. That's the other thing. I, I feel like I, I couldn't bring myself to do it. As open-minded as you are, you can't... You can't change reflex, you know? Um, I think I can do another, another batch of... Parsnip. There's other foods that I'm forgetting, but in general, that's, I guess, how I feel about that stuff. So it's like when that stuff is at the barbecues that we have for family stuff. It's there, and I've tried it before, and I'm not, I didn't dislike it. It was okay. But I'm not going to be like, I'm going to go, I'm going to go have it again. Not when there's, like, barbecue ribs and chicken and a whole bunch of other stuff that I'll enjoy just way more. It just looked foul. See... I appreciate the pun, but the accurate thing is it, it looks semi-foul. 
Because it's not quite a foul. Almost had it. <laughs> oh, whatever. Haha. <laughs> Yeah, well. That's what you get. And then there's stuff where I, I will never try it, like... There's... Such a thing as chicken sashimi. And that is something where... Even if it was like... If they would sign a contract that said they would give me like a million dollars if things went wrong, I wouldn't try it. It's just, it just doesn't seem right. Or like, there's a type of cheese, uh, it's quite literally maggot cheese. So, there's stuff like that that, yeah, no, I'm good. Um, I'm gonna go... I don't know how many I need to get. I'll just guess. Oh yeah, gifts. For a million, you do that in a second? What? No, a million... You don't get a million for trying it. You get a million if they do something that makes you sick. Basically, that's what I'm saying. Like, if they prepare it for you, and it's perfectly fine. I don't know, man. I guess it's the same as Fugu, like, that's another thing where it has to be done correctly to have, and I don't know, I don't want to roll the dice on that. I have to drive, like, 20 miles to buy decent clothes. That's why I usually just order online. What? You've never heard of that. Raw beef and fish or but chicken? Yeah. It's, it's, it's a thing. I thought it wasn't, like, someone was messing with me when I heard of it for the first time, but it is a- it is a thing, believe it or not. It's not- it's something that is under the strictest of standards that you have to prepare it. You're sweet, thanks. Alright. Sophia is ignoring you, she looks sad. Why? She's cute. Yeah, she's into cosplay. That's her hobby. Oh my, what a lovely day. Oh hey, taking a break from work? Okay, what is it? Copper ores. You can keep the ores, that's a good one to do. That's always a good one to do. I don't know, 25, and I'll go purchase a salad or two. You see that as an absolute win? Hopefully she likes roleplay. Oh, man. Yeah. It's a good day for foraging. You could make some decent coin. I wonder if any of Victor's friends want a part-time job cleaning the house. What is it with both of these people wanting a butler? <laughs> A 
I wish Abby wouldn't spend so much time in her room. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. It's just like... As long as both people are into it, why not? I wouldn't have the expectation from the outset, but sure would be nice. Okay, uh, I need to hurry up. What, what are you doing now? Ahoy, Wario. You've been angling for some time now with that fishing experience under your belt. I recommend casting your line over at Sheer Water Bridge, east of Pelican Town. I've done that. You'll learn some good whoppers there. Okay, so they're telling you about the dogfish. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna take the fishing rod with me. Just in case I want to try and go for the stonefish again. I'm not even sure what the quickest way is anymore. Wait, so when you say, like, D&D, &D, what do you mean, Lolo? <laughs> I want you to elaborate on that one. Unless that was just, like, a, a jokingly naive way of saying, oh, like, that kind of roleplay, like, you Dungeons and Dragons. Mario helps me out in the lab. She's a good kid. Yeah, I'm not sure that's what Nikto meant in terms of roleplay. I mean, it might be. I don't know. Maybe I'm the one with the, the mind in the gutter. No, you meant she hope she enjoys role playing the characters she cosplays as. Okay, so I'm the one with the mind in the gutter. that counts towards it. Will's mind is on the dungeons more than the dragons, in other words. Man. That's, that's such a stretch to make innuendo with Dungeons and Dragons. Okay. Okay. 
I mean, I guess. Let's just go down. Why not? Yeah, let's just ignore you. Oh, there's another one here. Ah! I haven't have had one drop a crab. Highly convenient. Okay. <laughs> sure are a lot of bugs. One of the line cooks asked you an interesting question tonight. Oh? What was the question? Okay, not so lucky on this floor. There we go. Um, I'm not sure it's worth sacrificing a salad, but what I can do is make a bug steak to give me just a little bit more energy to get through this. Okay, hold on. I'll see the question in a sec. I just need to focus for like the next minute. I might have to leave this. I'm not sure I can make it. Unless it appears right now. Nah, okay, we're leaving. Leaving. If this was closer, I, I could have pushed it for another 30 seconds. Okay, hang on. When you're on a first date, what's the first thing you look at in your partner to judge if you like them or not? Is this... Well, that's... I guess... Hang on. I might be overthinking the question, but do you mean physically or do you mean from a, like, qualitative point of view? Because I feel like they're two different answers. So I put the salad away. Um, that's foraging, so we'll take it. I think I've used all my sap. Okay. 
You think she meant physically, but you gave a quality answer. So either way. Yeah. That's fair. Oh, cool. Preserve star. Okay, I just need to find the rest of the ore. <laughs> Dear Wario, tomorrow we are all getting together for the flower dance. Um, to answer the question from a qualitative perspective, for me, it's... Um, they have to be nerdy. In one way or another. It doesn't matter for what, it's just like... Needs to be interested in something and can talk about it. More or less. Because then that person is more, more likely to understand when I'm being nerdy about something. Because there's nothing worse than someone trying to change who you are because they're not into nerdy stuff. So, that's my answer. And there are, there are generally red flags verbally when someone isn't nerdy, so that's, that's mine. They might be perfectly nice, but ultimately it'll be a thing where, yeah, they're just, it's not the same kind of mindset. Uh, tomorrow we're getting together for the flower dance. Okay. I wasn't, like, avoiding the question. I was just... <laughs> I was thinking, okay, what am I doing here? Like, getting... Getting my mind ready for this day here. I guess I can sell the silver ones. I don't really need. Um, this can go here. I need to take one for the bundle. Hang on, I'll move these because these are where I'm keeping gifts and misc stuff, so... Um... Okay, I need to make tappers. Make them afford the right. Okay, three. Okay, hang on. You said the first thing you judge is if they're on time and or openly communicating, meeting well. You feel like it's a good sign if they care enough to meet up on time or let you know if they're going to be late. That's true. Fair call. Okay, now... I should probably tap some trees that are nearby. Um, that can be one. So that's pine tar. Um, what is... Okay, I think I got the two trees here. This one's maple syrup. And this one's oak resin. Okay. What's that? Damn it, I could have tapped this one. In fact, it's not too late. I can change. I can change my mind. I can change my mind because it doesn't affect the day. All right, that's even that's even better. They're all within the same vicinity. I'm good. Now I just need to make sure that nothing bad happens to these trees.
Uh, should I? Well, I guess I should plant more. It's just going to contribute to being able to get the uh, the building, the coop built. I'll go buy more. Okay, that's going to give one more yield. Wait, I missed this. A couple of girls have recognized what your tattoo is. And that always sends you into an awkward flamingo mode. <laughs> uh... I mean, wouldn't the thing be to ask what their character is? Isn't that like the common icebreaker is like, what do you, what do you play as? Or do you play? Um, okay, let's go deliver this. Oh, I should... Right, this guy. I don't know what he likes for his birthday, so I'm just gonna assume... You got a daffodil. I mean, I guess a flower is universal-like. But I don't have many of them. What am I doing? Okay, so he is... Where is he? Across the bridge. He's at home. Wait, is he? No, he's not here. Where is he? Andy. Oh, cut! What? No, did I just did I just miss him? Did I really just miss him? <laughs> wait, 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 Andy. Wait, what? No. Wait, what, where is what, where is he? What? What do you mean? He's down here. Right? No. What? What the? <laughs> where? Where is he? Where is that? <laughs> uh, what do you what do you mean? <laughs> Where is he? Hey, Ander. I don't know where he is. 
Okay, whatever, I'll catch up with him later. I don't know where that is. Here you go. I don't enjoy dancing. I'm only going to the Fowl Festival for free cake. Alright, whatever. I, I give up. I don't know where he is. It, it, it doesn't matter. A great idea can pass through your head when you least expect it, but if your mind is too busy, you might miss it. I need to- I need to go- I need to stop worrying about Andy. I need to go and buy stuff to plant, and then go to the mines, because I need to finish this. Damn it, they're all here. Okay, that'll do. Even if there's leftover, it doesn't matter. Okay. It's great. Yep, it's great. He's on the vision quest deep in the woods. It's probably some area that I'm unaware of. Okay, look, we're not gonna read because they're just making sounds as they work out in front of a roaring fire. Okay, yep, sorry, old man. It's like the roughest planting you will see. Okay, uh, in you go. Let's be careful not to put these away. I'll sell this one. Um, this can go back. Alright, let's go. <laughs> he's fucking with me. He's, he's back at home now, right? He's back at home. So if I go in that direction, he's going to be there and not leave like last time. Should just give him this poisonous mushroom for making him waste my fucking time. If I didn't need it for a bundle, I would do it. Okay, he's here. Happy birthday. Okay. We're going to the... F yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe I'll find some good forage on the way there. Okay. I mean, this whole- uh, is his whole character arc? Is it really going to be that, um... That we just clean his house? Like, I feel like I can see this coming a mile away. Like, his character arc is we clean his house. <laughs> he needs a maid. Every- every new character in this town needs a maid. The rich people need a maid. The dude that works at the Jojo Mart needs a maid. Okay. 
Plus your local... Oh, right. Yeah, um, here. They need a butler. Okay, I know there's a difference. Yeah, tomorrow's the worst festival of the year by a mile. Just wait and see how stupid I look during the flower dance. I'm so edgy, bro. Like, not looking forward to this, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Just to show everyone, you know, that I'm a deep person, deeper than you think, on the surface. You might think, man, that Sebastian's too cool to do the dance. He's not gonna do it just out of protest. Well, I'll show them. I'll show them that they can't look at my preconceived notions. I forgot to, uh, you know what, it's cool. Bun don't worry about bundle, bundle can happen anytime. This has a time limit. How many more do I have left to find? Okay, uh, like, not too many. Such a rebel that he's not a rebel, exactly. He's all about being meta. Exploded in the wall and I got nothing. Okay, good timing. Not many left. I'm guessing this mod has upped the spawn rate, because these this is a lot. There's not usually this many of them. I know I'm pushing my luck here, but if I can get it in the next minute. Uh, I need to get the minecart first. Oh, come on, dude. Okay, I have to find it. I have to find it. I have to find it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. One more, one more, one more. One more, one more, one more, one more, one more. One more. Okay, this works. Just any, any source of copper, please. I might have to bail. Okay. Get it, got it, good. Out, 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 out. I have a minute to get home. Oh, but I have to talk to Clint. Shit. Um, he's gone, right? There's, there's no way. Yeah. Fuck. This was a waste of time! It's okay, I think I'll make it. Yeah. <laughs> 
I think I'll make it. I think I'm okay. <laughs> yes, I had to do that. Okay. I feel like that's unfair. I should be allowed to redeem it even after it's done. It's like, I got the deed done. It's gone. Yeah, it's gone. Great. Okay, cashback rewards program. Thank you. I got 590 back from him. I have enough to- almost enough to build the, uh, coop. I mean, look. I wouldn't say it's a complete waste of time. I did get something out of it, ultimately. No. <laughs> what? Okay, there we go. Parsnips are done. That's it. I have... Oh, I already had. Okay, so the five need to go to the bundle. The rest can go. So this is bundle. Um... Oh, exotic foraging. Okay. What else do we have? Adventurers. How much? Ninety-nine, okay. It's a full stack. Then we don't have that yet. Oh. Well, I guess I can plant again. They will be done in time. I, I should. I should probably do it. Um, another four. Okay. Oh, no. Another seven. Because the rice is ready. Where did I put the scythe? There it is. I'm falling victim to this again, where it's like, I'm like one more day and then I look at the time and I'm like, oh, okay, it's, it's that time. Time slips away from you with this game, very easily. It's okay, like, I'm on holiday, so it doesn't matter, but... Yeah, one more day is, you're talking about like another half hour, depending on what you do in that day. Oh, shit. It's the flower dance. Okay, so I can't purchase crop. Okay, so don't water those tiles because it's a waste. Not that I'll be able to do anything afterwards anyway. I always hate that they're closed on events. It's like, imagine businesses closing for like what is effectively a high school dance. <laughs> Could you imagine?
Okay, I mean, I'm gonna try my luck, but I, I doubt it's gonna be open. I might just go drop off the stuff so it's kind of forget. Says the guy who has a holiday for a horse race. Okay, listen, it's... It's a horse race that has historical significance, okay? There's a reason that it's it's a public holiday. And as I said before, you can't ignore. It's Wednesday anyway. Fuck, you're right. <laughs> so either way, I was screwed. Ah, <sighs> okay. Andy, as I said before, you can't ignore. No, you listen to me. What, uh, what intonation is that supposed to mean? Don't come telling me I owe more. I'm fine. I'm just fine with Bear and Farm. Don't you go telling me this is bad news. It's out of my hands. The Fern Gill government just adjust. Oh, wait, wrong voice. Well, I'm not hearing any of this. This will ruin me. Yeah. I thought this valley supported local farmers. The mayor of Grambleton isn't happy with this either. I'm in no way trying to. No, the answer is no, Lewis. I can barely afford my seeds for a new harvest. I can't afford this at all. Andy, everything will be okay. I'm going to divert funds from the fest. I don't need no one's help. I don't accept handouts. I'll figure something out. Andy. This conversation's over. I'm leaving. And on the day after his birthday, man. Hello, Warrior. You heard all of that, didn't you? <sighs> the Ferngill government is introducing new regulations. I don't think they understand negative impact it's having on small communities like this one. I've tried negotiating, but they wouldn't listen to me. I'm aware Andy is struggling, and he isn't doing well financially. Rest assured, Warrior, Kendra and I are drafting an elaborate proposal. Who's Kendra? <laughs> Who's Kendra? Can you do me a favor and check on Andy? I'll check on him. Thank you, Warrior. This is most appreciated. I'm going to go start that draft now. Have a nice day, Warrior. I'll go check on him, provided he doesn't go to the netherworld and disappear from existence like he did on his birthday. Okay, I might be pushing with time. I should probably go to that dance before they're like, nah, we're done. But I just wanted to do this while I'm here. I think it's... There's still time, maybe. If not, I'll just reset the day. It's cool. It's not like much was going to happen today anyway. Okay. Um... Where's flower? Flower's in the other one. Crap! That's a pretty easy one. I mean, maybe I do have an easy community center. Luck will not be on your side today, apparently. I just need to appear in the forest, right? Okay, we're good. Oh, right. Yeah, what? Oh. Oh, this is weird. It's 
So, I mean, relative to the new map, where exactly is this now? Um, I'm not gonna bother with recipes yet. I don't have to give a present. So, I don't have to purchase the rare crow. Okay, let's just talk to everyone. Oh, I'm stuffed. Hey, have you tried the red jelly yet? No. I wore my best shirt for the dance. This sort of thing doesn't happen very often. Hi, Warrior. Glad to see you here. I should have brought my fishing pole. Now, this is the life. Hot kid, sweet wine, a babbling brook, warm air. Did I mention wine? Frog season is really starting to pick up. Wait, what do you mean, frog season? Did he always say that? You know what? I admit it. I really like flowers. Ugh. I really hate dancing in front of everyone. It's so embarrassing. I'm here for the free cake. This is the strawberry jello. It's truly remarkable. Are you going to be dancing today, warrior? These springtime dances can be traced back to ancient for... Okay. Ah, the air smells so sweet with all these flowers. Gatherings such as this give me a great opportunity to talk to Carolyn and Jody. Oh, no, 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 no. Hmm, excellent sauce. I've been working on these floral arrangements for a week. Do you like them? I found some leaks during our walk over here. This stuff is better than most of the food here. Flowers? I can hardly see them. I'm just enjoying the scenery. I'm practicing my dance moves. It needs to be perfect. Marnie looks lovely today. Ugh, love is in the air and I'm still single. Wait. I th Does she- wait. But isn't- isn't she like doing stuff with Lewis? I suppose she could be doing stuff with Lewis and not be in a relationship. Maybe that's like a hint towards Lewis. Hint, hint. Oh, hello there. It's nice of you to talk to me. Spring is almost over. What a shame. I'm working up the courage to ask someone to dance with me. I'm nervous. <laughs> I like dancing, but this one's a little stilted. The old timers really love it, though. She's still single. They're just hiding the salami. Uh, fair enough. A girl can be single and have people lose their boxes in their bedroom. Okay, listen. I have a theory that he didn't... He's not an idiot. He's doing this shit on purpose. Like, who the fuck goes to someone and is like, Hey, listen, I have I have a favor to ask. Can you go fetch my underwear for some, from someone's house? No questions asked. Oh, hey, listen. I hope you didn't find that note um, that says to go to this particular bush. At this particular time of night, you know? Sure hope you didn't find that note. Hey, can I have some... Some oil? It's like, yeah, sure you can have some oil. I promise it's for nothing uh, suspicious. It's just, I just want some, some truffle oil. Nothing suspicious. Why do you have to say nothing suspicious? Well, because it's nothing suspicious, I'm certainly not using it for sex. You know? It's, it's, it's certainly not a sex thing. By the way, did you find that note? <laughs> okay. I'm certain that the thrill of getting caught, like, gets him off. And that's... <laughs> that's why. <laughs> oh man, I'm, I'm laughing too much and I'm coughing. Uh, that's why. It's just, he gets off on the thrill of being caught. Okay, let's see if it works. Sorry, I don't really dance. Oh, she doesn't want to. Never mind. If someone says definitely not a sex thing, it's a sex thing. I'm not gonna buy anything. Well, I don't have the money. And there's no condition where I have to buy someone a present to dance with them. 
She accepts that your friendship's high enough. I guess it's not high enough. I thought it was just two, but maybe not. It's like... Two and a bit? I did my best, but it wasn't gonna work out. I would like to buy the rare crow, but I can't. I don't have enough. It completely slipped my mind. In, in my mind, this was at the end of the month, but it's not. Okay, so this hasn't changed. It's still the same. But yeah, I'm pretty convinced, like, this dude hides out in the open and wants to get caught. <laughs> or he's just really stupid. Maybe he just is really stupid. There are people that are really dumb and go do stuff in plain sight, despite them potentially getting caught. That was fun. Time to go home. Uh, I guess I can't really do much else. I could gamble with the mixed seeds, but I'm just gonna save them. Um, that's gonna take eight days, and yeah, I got nothing to do. Okay. Last day. <laughs> I was checking your shipping bin. What? What are you doing? Pierre and Sophia had a large number of products to ship this morning. Warrior, I'm very happy you're getting situated here in Saudi Valley, and you're making great progress on Warrior's farm. I need to walk over to Fairhaven Farm and check if Andy is shipping anything. He usually has high quality forage from the Cindersap Forest. It must be convenient to be able to forage in your own backyard. I'll leave you to your farm work. Oh, right, because he sells stuff. That's why. Thought he was just being a creep and just going through my shit. But he's the one that picks stuff up and then sells it. <laughs> he's obsessed with Andy. Is he? I mean, there is a bit of a money situation going on with him right now, so... I don't know, I don't know if it's an obsession, but... It's... Elevated interest, perhaps. Okay, I need to sell these again. But that's all 15 now, I don't have to sell anymore after this point. Um, I'm keeping cauliflower because Jody asks for it every now and then. And I wasn't going to hit the quota anyway, so... Oh, maybe I might. We'll see. Unfortunately, stuff's going to be growing until the very final day, so I can't um, do an upgrade. It's okay. I think today's focus will primarily be, I need to make the money to get this coop happening next time. I'm not sure if I'm making good time in terms of that, like, I feel like I should have had it sooner.
But then again, I do have two ancient fruits, so... There's a few things that I'm well ahead on. There's also the wild card if tomorrow coffee is available for purchase. That's something that I will probably take. So we'll see. Uh, that's everything. Oh, one more. Now that's everything. Uh, I think I gifted her everything, right? Yeah, okay. Then that can wait. Put that away. I need to cut more wood, but that can wait. Okay. What can I make from a food perspective? I'm just thinking. I think I can make... I might be able to make one more bar. Okay, I can make two. Alright, that'll do. And I shall go fish. The thing is, I'm not tired, but I don't want to be sitting at the computer and not attempting to get rest. So I'll probably watch some TV for a bit, but yeah. <laughs> I don't want to keep sitting here because I'll keep playing it. My mind's going to be wired on this. That's the thing. It's keeping me awake. Uh, hello, you want to talk? Do you watch Schoolgirl Wizards? Oh, you don't? That's okay. I wonder what that's in reference to. Sailor Moon? That would probably be my guess. Good? Oh, is, is that what it, it's in reference to? No. What's it in reference to, then? Schoolgirl Wizards, what would that be? Oh, good that I'm getting hooked. I mean, it's always been the case with this game, and it's tradition. I play this every year around Christmas time. This game got me through the period where I didn't have internet. I would play this on my Switch every night because I I couldn't watch stuff on I couldn't watch stuff on YouTube or anything. It was three months of just that. Trying to think if I'm forgetting anything for today, but I don't think I am. I think I'm good. But yeah, I'm doing it so I don't stay up all night and then ruin my sleep pattern.
I could very well do it, but yeah. I'm not gonna. Hopefully this gives me enough money to, uh... Well, I'll either get the coop or it'll be coffee. Well, that's basically it. One or the other. I already have enough money for coffee, it's just... I'll either purchase that or the coop. I suppose I should think about where to put it. Wait, if I hit level six... And it rains. I might have the prerequisite to catch legend. Oh, iron. Nice. I can't remember if it was 7 or 10. It might be 10. But with trout soup, you can have the prerequisite to be able to do it. I wouldn't have the fishing rod, I guess. In a playthrough where I'm being completely antisocial, I will catch Legend in the first season. <laughs> Just focusing on work and no relationships whatsoever. You can totally do it. Okay, let me eat this. Ah, damn it. Wasn't perfect. Ha 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 ha. I've had pretty good luck. Ah, oh, I didn't get the treasure. But it was going to make it in time. It's okay. I've already got good stuff out of it. Well, Gus can have that diamond since I already have one.
Hopefully the quality of fish that I'm catching is good too. I want that money. I realize that I'm extending this day quite a bit by doing this. <laughs> you have to stop time constantly. I will run out of energy soon, so. This is the last day. Yeah. It's like, it's almost 2 a.m. here. I should consider making a move to bed. The season's almost over. Yeah, but it, it might not sound like a lot, but three days is like another hour and a half. Almost. I can't do that. <laughs> Including whatever's left of this one. It's like it's about an hour and a half. I'm not underestimating how much time is left. You thought I said I could? Yeah. But I'm not gonna. There's always tomorrow. Is the what? How, how long has it been? Like, four hours? Is four hours really not enough? Uh, excuse me? <laughs> what is this? Yeah, four hours. Wow. I, hey, I actually have perception of time on this one. But what is it? It has a face. I just feel, I don't know, weird if I do this sort of thing on a weekday. Stay up super late. Friday and Saturday, maybe, but, like... Yeah. Okay, uh... Huh. I mean, three wood's not really going to make much of a difference. If I'm on holidays, all days are a weekend. Yeah, but then when I go back to work, I don't want bad habits. Okay, come on, last cast. Something other than seaweed. Which I don't get, understand why that has... I suppose it's a technical limitation. I was like, wait, why am I reeling in seaweed? 
the other seaweed isn't real, then, then then I guess it's probably a technical limitation. Uh, hello there. Andy is ignoring me. <laughs> what do you want? Leave me alone. Man, these two. I can't say that I know too much about Pelican Town. Sorry, I should be going. It's okay, Cat. I understand that you want me to stream more. That's fine. But... I need to look out for my sleep pattern and not let it get destroyed. Uh, hang on. I mean, I don't... Uh, I should probably just sell that. Okay, hang on. Sardine. Do the old swap. Uh, I guess. Hang on to it. I don't know why. Put that in there. Right? I think that's okay. Oh, and keep one flounder. Okay. Following the rule. Keep one fish just in case. Okay, and, uh, there we go, that's our new sword. Yes. Okay. Wow, I was expecting more money. So, I mean, either way, I'm going to have to make a choice here. Yeah, it's not enough to afford both. Oh, no, wait, 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 wait. She doesn't work on Fridays, does she? Does she, she doesn't work on Fridays, does she? Or am I, no, I'm thinking of Clint. Clint doesn't do shit on Fridays. One of them doesn't do anything on Fridays. Who who was it? It doesn't matter. <laughs> I'll find out next time. All right. Save and exit. Uh, I'm gonna make a move to bed. Otherwise, I'm not gonna fall asleep. I need to let my mind unwind. I'll play more of this tomorrow. So yeah, if you want more Stardew. I'll do something before it and then play it afterwards, so. Thank you for watching, appreciate it. It's nice uh, seeing a bunch of faces again, so. Enjoy the rest of your day. <laughs>